I'm Mike. And I'm Henry, and welcome to our Namakwa to Riftersfeld adventure. Where I'm driving my Suzuki Jimny. And I'm driving the Defender 130. Good morning. The morning after the wedding. But yeah, today uh, we set off about early-ish on our way to Pofada. Uh, stop at Oma, stop there for some cake and tea. And then we're off, we're hitting the first dirt road. Um, and before that, obviously, we're filling up, just getting some firewood and all the extras that Mike forgot um, at his camp. And then we're pretty much at the start of the Namakwa Echo 4x4 route. Just leaving Pofada now, uh, we've officially switched off uh, map source for the streets and Tracks for Africa is on, en route to Kleinpala, we're going to hit the dirt road in about 15 kilometers, let down some tires and then the final stretch to the first night at the camp where Mike is currently waiting for us. First dirt road, last tar road for probably a week, and 27 k's to the campsite, and then we can crack open a beer, finally. Even though we deflated the wheels and pugly to about one bar, the road was still in pretty bad condition. This rattling went on for a few kilometers. It was probably 15 k's into the dirt road that this rattling kind of turned into a big problem. It was about here that I completely lost my brakes. So after backtracking a whole 60 kilometers back to Pofada, we had to go fix my brakes Hello. somehow, somewhere, on Hello. a Sunday afternoon. Hello, Wolfies. Hello, Wolf. Right, so, bit of a problem. We got into the dirt road, very bad, corrugated. And suddenly I had no brakes. Um, stopped, checked it out, Zon pumped the brakes. I checked for any leaks, no leaks were found. And then suddenly we had brakes again. So I drove 100 meters and then the brakes, brakes were screeching. So we found out the one brake pad fell out. Um, obviously the pins that kept it in place didn't have the circlips in. Yeah. And we're trying to retrofit Hilux brakes, which are a bit smaller. Um, but we see if we can make that work. Somehow continue to try and go find our brake pads, which we missed coming our way back. So yeah. Now thanks to my cousin and some old brake pads from Prado laying around, we eventually got them to fit. Now this wasn't the best braking performance that Pugli had, but it was better than nothing and it was safe enough for us to continue on the rest of the trip. This was all done on a Sunday afternoon. Luckily I could finish it up and then meet up with the rest of the gang on the same day. Sure. So it seems like the Prado brake pad on the Landy Caliper, which is reamed out so it fits, works, as far as we can tell now. Um, it's safe enough so we can actually proceed with our trip and join up with Mike tonight. This is take two, Pugly stopped up again and we're leaving Pofada again. So hopefully this time we can actually reach uh, Claim Pala. Uh, the fault was just the minor split pin that was missing and obviously the things came loose so no fault really there on Pugly's behalf. Well luckily we had Neil Miller, Mr. Miller could actually help us out. 
So now the brakes are working good again um, and we're safe to reach our destination later on. So we're pushing through to meet Mike at Lampella and then continue our trip. Good morning, Andrew. Good morning. Just getting the pans for our breakfast. Hey, come fat. We uh, we've got a quite a long road ahead. I had to fill up, take extra jerry cans because the Germany's tank is only 40 liters. We've got a range of about 350 to 400, depending on terrain. And we're just emptying the one can. We've got our little spout here but the problem is this tank is leaking the rubber obviously isn't sealing properly so we just have to empty it, empty it via this thing and not the usual jerry can fitting otherwise it leaks too much okay. right so everything is almost packed up and ready to go here at the clan pala campsite and in about an hour's time, we're gonna hit the official Echo 4x4 route of Namakwala. All the vehicles, all fluids are topped up, and we should be good to go in T minus hour's time. Half an hour. Hour. Oh. 10 minutes. Oh wow. Yeah, 10 minutes. Cool stuff. And we'll be on our way. Let's go. Rustersfeld. Woo! If you liked this video, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell button to be notified when the next video is released. Feel free to share this to family and friends and don't forget to leave a comment and like. See you guys till next time.